With the city finally in phase one of reopening, Mayor de Blasio says the focus is now on a testing strategy. He calls it test, trace and take care. So I'm reminding all New Yorkers, as you prepare, as these phases begin, as life starts back towards something better, get tested. The mayor is making it clear there is no excuse not to get tested. Here's what you need to know. Whether you have symptoms or not, get tested. The tests are free and you do not need insurance. The results are returned in about 48 hours. There are over 200 testing sites citywide, including mobile units that the city has already begun rolling out. The focus would be on the hardest hit communities. The testing come right to your doorstep. De Blasio is putting an emphasis on testing as we begin to go back to work or school. New York City is the last region to move into phase one. Long Island has already moved into phase two with salons, stores and outdoor dining coming back to life. Customers lined up six feet apart and inside other precautions are in place as they get long awaited haircuts at Pat's Barbershop in Levittown. Over in Port Washington, diners enjoyed a meal al fresco while social distancing on the dock of Louis Grill. Waitstaff had on masks and gloves. This has been a great opportunity for all of us to start feeling as if we're human beings again and start interacting with other people. Back in New York City, no exact date on when we will move into phase two. It all depends on keeping those numbers down. The country's leading infectious disease expert, Dr. Anthony Fauci, with a warning today. That when you open, that doesn't mean that everything is okay and you just can just do whatever you want. You still have to practice a degree of caution. And city officials also advise if your first test is negative, you will want to get tested again if you have since been exposed to someone with a possible or confirmed case of COVID or if you've been around a large gathering. In the past several days, both the governor and the mayor have been urging all those protesters to get the COVID test. We're live on the east side tonight. I'm Shirley Chan, PIX11 News.